It's, it's Brandon Ayuk versus Debo Samuel Kroc. And I know you're a huge wide receiver guy. I think wide receiver is quickly becoming one of my favorite positions in the NFL. So before we get into the specifics with these guys, um, how would you kind of compare Debo Samuel and Brandon Ayuk um, physically against each other? You know, how they stack up with their measurables. I'd say just overall, their ability is pretty similar for the most part, even more probably closer than a lot of fans would give it credit for. I'd say the biggest difference is Ayuk is a little bit more finesse, while Debo, Debo is just a little bit more like pure, like brute strength, powerful. So in the, in the way that he plays, just their their styles and, and which how they play. So I think right away, that's the biggest difference. I, I think when you look at both of those guys, to be honest, like Debo Samuel too, I think Debo Samuel has some really good aspects to his game, even route running, and it's kind of overlooked because of how he's kind of been utilized in the Shanahan offense. So he's not viewed or looked at as a great route runner, right? Like how people look at Brennan Ayuk, like, oh, route, route, route runner, Ayuk, he's, he's terrific at that. But I think Debo Samuel is just damn near as good with how he is able to run routes and understands uh, leverage and how to attack uh, you know, blind spots and go the other way. And I think, you know, his feet are really good. Again, he does think some things with a little bit more power than finesse, but I think that's a really uh, underrated aspect to Debo's game. And, and then you look at Ayu, and I feel like he's just kind of scratching the surface. You know, he was a guy who played multiple positions at Sierra Junior College. You know, he, he was recruited by Alabama to play defensive back. Right. And, you know, he ended up going to – Arizona, obviously, for a couple years and, you know, excelling in his senior year. But I still think that there's a little bit more there in the sense of being, like, consistent with a lot of the talent that he possesses. So, you know, really understanding how to play faster. I, I thought last year he did a lot of things, you know, very well. The one thing I, I don't want to say I was underwhelmed about, but I would like to see him improve on is that after the catch. Now, obviously, like, you know, we saw the, the, the play against – Philadelphia, yeah. where they got the ball to him in space, and he did what he did, jumped over a guy. I saw it in your intro. But oh, yeah. on a consistent basis, I thought he was pretty regular after the catch. Like, that, if there's, you know, when you talk about comparing the two guys, I'd say that's where Debo, at least last season, or, and, you know, at least Debo has been with the 49ers and Ayuk's rookie year. Debo has a big edge and just yard, not just yards after catch, but making guys miss. You know, getting those yards that don't look like they're really there to be had. I thought Debo excels at that. I think Ayuk I, I, got the yards that you expected him to get and didn't really give you much more than that unless it was blocked up better. So I think that's an area where he can improve. But that would be kind of my long-winded version of a comparison of the two.